Hey everybody, it's Niall Doherty here from $50blogs.net. There's a picture of my face. I'm going to show you in this screencast how to find the best free WordPress theme so you can get your blog looking all nice and slick and professional like. Uh, there's a lot of ways you can do this, but before we jump into it, let me tell you what I mean by uh, a good free WordPress theme because my definition might be different to other people. So let's jump on over here. This is a list on $50blogs.net of uh, some really good free WordPress themes. We'll get back to that in a minute. Over here in the sidebar is my criteria by which I select these themes. So run through these quick. It must be free, obviously enough. It must have a professional grade design because the devil's in the details. Uh, must have a solid back-end functionality so you don't have to go hack away at the code to make common modifications and must be compatible with the latest version of WordPress press at the time of posting. So those are all very important things to look for in a free theme, whether you find them uh, via $50blogs.net or elsewhere. Speaking of elsewhere, let's see where we can find such themes. The We'll start with the most obvious one, which is the WordPress.org free themes directory. So this is one option. You can find free themes here. Actually, I'm getting a little ahead of myself. Let's jump back. This is the homepage of the free themes directory. And it will show you some featured themes. It will show you most popular ones over here. You can see how many times they've been downloaded. You can see newest themes, uh, recently updated, etc., etc. If you click into view a theme, it will give you average rating and such. And you can see when it was last updated. All that good stuff, some statistics in there if you want to click. You can even preview the theme, which is nice. Now, other cool thing about WordPress.org's directory is this filter and tag interface. So let's click into that. Gives us all these handy checkboxes so you can narrow down your selections and find out a find exactly the type of theme that you're looking for. So for example, if you wanted a theme with a custom header, you'd select that. If you want it to be pink, you'd select that. And if you wanted to be a photo blog, you'd select that, and then you'd click on find themes up here, I guess. So uh, that's one way to do it. Uh, you can also access these controls via your own WordPress installation. Let's have a quick look at how you would do that. So here I am on the $50 demo blog and I'm logged into it. I went to appearance and then themes and then up here to the install themes tab. And we pretty much have the same interface here. Uh, you can search by a term, showing in a keyword or something there, or you can select these boxes and then click on Find Themes. And from doing it this way, you can uh, install directly the theme directly into your uh, installation. Does that make sense? Okay, we'll go with that. So it's a quick way to test out themes and activate themes and see what they look like on your blog. So WordPress.org. Uh, yeah, pretty common way, pretty uh, traditional way to find free WordPress themes, but I don't think you will find the best themes that way because there's a lot of crap on there, to be quite honest. So a better option is to go to this uh, thing called Google and type in best free WordPress themes. And it'll bring up um, some lists. So there's all sorts of design websites out there, WordPress websites that will list some top free WordPress themes. Um, here's a list of 65 free WordPress themes. Uh, a good thing to do when you go to these lists is look at the date. So this was pay posted May 7, 2011, which is less than six months ago as I'm recording this screencast. So it's pretty much still relevant. The themes here will still be fairly up to date and you can go down through and select which ones you like. So that can be a pretty good way. Use Google, find uh, some top 20 lists, top 65 plus lists, etc. Uh, you can find really good themes that way. Uh, but however, let's go to the next level, which I believe is an even better way to find free themes. And that is to go find uh, the best uh, for the best premium theme shops on the web. So in my opinion, one of those would be Woo Themes. Okay, now these are premium themes, they're not free, but the thing is that a lot of these uh, theme shops, they produce free themes as well um, to promote their stuff, to get the word out and to create a bit of buzz. So here in Woo Themes, I've already gone, I'm, I'm on the page now, I went to themes, let me run through it so you see, and then you click on free. 
and these guys are pretty legendary their themes are really well put together i've used quite a lot of them myself and they're free ones they don't cut any corners on those so these are really high quality free themes uh, as you can see here is swatch which is what i use for 50 blogs.net myself uh, but lots of themes in there lots of free ones you can preview them and download them install them play around with them uh, other uh, premium theme shops that you find as well such as studio press uh, there's tons of them out there but if you find f find those websites and look for any free themes that they're giving away they're usually going to be really really well put together because those guys they know what they're doing so that is the uh, one of the best ways to find free wordpress themes top free wordpress themes now i think personally that the best absolute best way to find really good free wordpress themes is to look at the list that i created because these are all handpicked using the methods that i showed you above and i update this regularly so i have them categorized as well so you can look through and find the themes that you want and you can click on this and see a quick big screenshot of each theme and you can browse through them pretty easily and see what you like and maybe what you don't like so have a look through this um, you can find some really great themes there as i said i'm handpicking the best ones myself um, if i find that a theme is no longer supported or it doesn't work with the current version of wordpress or just generally fails to measure up to my expectations upon further investigation then i strike it from this list and you won't have to worry about it so that's uh, that's the dealio that's that's how you find really good free wordpress themes online uh, your first stop should of course be this list right here best free wordpress themes just click on the free themes button at the top of 50 blogs.net but any of the other ways i show you are good too you might find a few that i haven't come across and if you think they're really good you can always uh, send them to me you can uh, let me know there's a little link here to let me know so that's that free wordpress themes uh, next week we're going to continue along the theme of themes if that makes sense and we'll be diving into installing themes and making some modifications and edits and stuff customizing the theme so it doesn't look quite like the default installation it looks a bit unique and you can stand out from the crowd so that's all that i've got Niall Doherty from $50blogs.net check it out we'll get you set up with a professional grade blog in 72 hours or less